Kenny. Um, you might know me already on my channel, Captain Kenny. And In the previous episodes of Life is Strange, we called film Little Pieces of Time. Because Max wants everybody to see I'm how so she is. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! Don't ever touch me again, freak! Totally but Kenny says this game is kind of like The Sims. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. And there she is. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Let's talk about your superpower. Hey. Stelma and Louise, you're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? You want me to cut you, bitch? Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Please, get me out of here! Max! Nobody cares about me. Nobody. <laughs> what are you doing here, Max? Now, I know today was difficult for everybody. Miss Coffee, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Please, tell us everything. What the hell is this? Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. <coughs> Don't nod entertainment. Entertainment against heroin. Looks like Max is asleep at the computer. This is the Chaos Theory. Episode number three. I knew Chloe would be all over this, so I better get moving. Well, it looks like Max is asleep at the computer. This is the Chaos Theory, episode number three. Chloe would be all over this. So I better get moving. You know you're hurting when you don't give a shit about music. It's amazing how happy Kate looks here compared to today. She was basically pushed up to that roof, and I will use my power to find out why. This has to end. There's been so much going on, I almost forgot about the eclipse. All this atmospheric action can't be a coincidence. And all roads are leading to my tornado vision. Let's feed the hamster. Are you a hungry bunny? Here, nosh on this. Anything else we need to do before we get out of here?
pretty hard to focus on my class schedule this week. I wonder why. <sighs> Kate's okay, Max. Take a breath. Get your shit together. You have time. Kate. Okay, this is scary dark. Let there be... Yeah. I thought I saved your life. If there's anything in the bathroom, girl, you were up at all hours of the night. What are you doing? Hey, Max, I saw you go up on the roof and save Kate. I can't believe she tried to jump. You should believe it. She almost jumped because you and everybody here bullied her. What? You're like blaming me? As a matter of fact, yes. Then just get out of here! Like, stop fucking with me! I've got my own family shit to deal with. I'm done for the day. I'm like, so selfish. Like, oh my god, I said you're not I'm done like, with done, me. Max. Please leave me alone. Kate probably won't want to look at these posters when she comes back. Okay, we're out of here. Nothing over here. Let's go. Uh, oh, what's this can party you come going? In here for a minute? Hey, Dana. How are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. I think we're all responsible for what happened. True. But you're the only one who went up to that roof with Kate. That was bullshit. Where was everybody else? I know. You're a better person than any of us here. Hey, Max, I think I need to crash now. I'm just over everything today. Oh, we're gonna choose the other choice. Let's go back in time. Right there. Hey, Dana. How are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. I think we're all responsible for what happened. True, but you're the only one who went up to that roof with Kate. I was lucky. That's all. No, girl. That was not luck. You made a choice to save her. Like a superhero. Then maybe it's time to catch the bad guys. So what exactly are you saying, Max? Do you think David Madsen is involved? He finally got his ass busted, too. It's complicated. I don't want to drag you into this, okay? Not yet, anyway. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sherlock? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. Yeah. I'll see you later. I am wiped out, Max. We'll talk later.
Aw, Trevor is a sweetie. Good for Dana. If Dana talks to Juliet about this, she's gonna wish she didn't. Yes, the Vortex Club does indeed suck. This is both sad and pathetic. Oh, Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. Going through her shit. Can I go in the door? No, I cannot. Alright, I'm out. So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. The most magical insects. Burn bright. The Tabanka does look pretty scary at night. Please don't destroy me. Healthier than oh, that. Cool. You're not supposed to be outside your dormitory at this hour. You know that. I, I'm sorry, Principal Wells. I'm still tense after I thought Kate was going to jump today. I just needed some air and space to walk. No, no explanation. Ah, uh, he's full. Seeing Kate come up on that roof, then seeing her come down with you. He's on that night train. You saved her ass. <sighs> Maybe I saved, saved your Blackwell. Ass too. Now don't get cocky. Going back inside. You earned good dreams. No, I'm gonna stay outside. So how do I get past him to meet Chloe? Max, stop wandering outside and get back to your dorm. Oh, great. He saw me. Maybe I could sneak by when he was trying to open the door. Blackwell almost lost another student. Okay, let's sneak by while he's trying to open the door. There you go, let's go. Let's go, 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 go. I know, I have a set of keys on me. Run! Why are Max you going so slow? Strikes again. Ah, gotcha. She's no stealth ninja. She's not even fast. I can't really figure out if this is supposed to be high school or college. If it's college, I don't know why they're worried about what time she comes and leaves at. Booyah! If it's high school, I don't know why she's living on the campus. Get it? Booyah. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. More like a scary punk asshole. Hey, Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing, and your badass power is gonna save us all. We just need to connect the plays. And find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? 
Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got your step fully suspended. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? We need to find out more about who Rachel was involved with around here. She was able to blend in with everybody. Even with people I hated. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... She's dead. Dead? I'm sorry. I hate even saying that, Chloe. Not as much as I hate thinking it. Max, we have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, step prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Thank you again so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted, as you know. Uh -oh. It's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know Jefferson's this has been an trying awful to hook day, up with what's her name? Victoria anytime, Chase. Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. I don't know what I would have done if Katie jumped. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? It doesn't. The contest is still a go, and I still have to pick the winner to best represent Blackwell. I've got all the photos, except one from Max. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria, please. But Jefferson and, really uh, seems to want to give I me the picked the prize. Right you already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun, don't you think? I'm going to think that you didn't say any of that. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Are you fucking kidding me? Uh-oh. It's so stupid. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. Not to mention the weed you brought into my room. Joking. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? They can't charge us for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not when Blackwell's ex-head of security is at home crying in his basement bunker. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. But my powers didn't save Kate. Maybe I did on my own. Come on, one more door and our work here is done.
All right, got ourselves a flashlight. Sneaking around in the school. Let's go change some grades. Maybe pull a fire alarm. Nothing here, nope. we not get out of this room? Here we go. Let's see what's in here. I don't know what I'm looking for, but I'm looking for something. And I don't even know why I'm in here. Only a total phony would wear a crappy hat like that. 